Welcome to the third of a series of five InfraWork videos that are designed to be an introduction to the fundamental uses of the software. My name is Dana Rice and I am the Civil 3D and InfraWorks Applications Engineer for TPM Incorporated. We're back in our Denver, Colorado model to see the grading functions of InfraWorks. In this video, I'll show you how quickly you can create a graded site and evaluate its cut and fill for preliminary design purposes. InfraWorks uses coverage areas and land areas. The difference is that land areas can have a grading style with uh, slope or grading assigned to them. So I'm going to add a land area that will represent a parking lot for my site. You can see that we have a, um, we're given our area automatically. My land area now has grading information. Terrain statistics in InfraWorks is the equivalent to a cut and fill evaluation in Civil 3D. As I've mentioned in the previous videos in this series, InfraWorks is best used as a preliminary engineering software. InfraWorks also has intelligent design capabilities though, so you can see some construction quantities in the earliest stages of your project. Here we have our cut and fill, and as you saw earlier, we also were given an area. InfraWorks also comes with several decorative features that can enhance your site and add some realism. put a row of trees in here between our parking lot and the lake. There are also some uh, vehicles, there are people, signs. There is a plethora of objects available that ship with the software. And InfraWorks allows you to build separate proposals or phases of your project for easy comparison. Our Denver, Colorado model has proposals built in to show this particular project's phases. Here's our final with the building and there's actually a detention pond, parking striping. There is a detention pond surface that was created in Civil 3D. In the next video in our series, we will explore importing and exporting between Civil 3D and InfraWorks. Thank you very much for your time today. My name is Dana Rice, and I am the Civil 3D and InfraWorks Applications Engineer for TPM Incorporated.